how you guys doing? Cribs, come on in, let me show you around. Uh, you guys are a little early, so I never really had a chance to clean up. That was the last girl that was here. She must have left in a hurry and forgot her shoes. Oops. Uh, so, I'm Mitch Kranz. I'm the owner of Better Boa, Snake Breeder. You'll get to see those in a little bit. Uh, I'll show you the rest of the place first. This is the living room. We got our table up here. It's where we like to play poker. I like to win all the cash off of the buddies. Uh, couch, sit around. We got the Sharp Aquas upstairs, 42 inch PS2 for when you like to go old school. Switch it up a bit, you know. Then I got uh, one of my first exotic pets here to show you. It's a poison arrow frog. He's chilling in there, that's his terrarium, it's all live plants, self-sufficient. Um, let me show you the rest of the place. Pizza Pops, Pizza Pops, call me, I need an endorsement, better boa. Uh, a little more pizza in there, some, uh, I don't even know what those are, chicken cutlets. Uh, yeah, I'll show you downstairs, got another living room down here, where we all like to hang out. The one rule is though, when going downstairs in my house, you're going to have to stop. Alright, so this is the downstairs living room. Uh, this is where I like to relax. It's a little cooler down here in the basement. It's nice in the summer. I got the Mac computer. Uh, it's one of the biggest screens they got. There's no big hard drive or nothing. It's all built right into the screen. So I'm definitely enjoying that. Uh, then we got 46 inch down here. LCD projection. Uh, the PS3. The HD DVR. I like to keep uh, keep up to date on all my favorite shows. Big Brother, watching you. Uh, got all my DVD collection, pretty extensive. Uh, PS3 games, Blu-rays, HD DVD, everything, man. Don't worry about it. We got you covered. Laser disc, Blu-ray, Betamax, Blu-ray, Betamax. Anyway, we'll head on past here. Uh, just watch out for all these beer cans. Fucking, it's a little crazy around here. That's thanks to uh, this guy, number one uh, brother. He's been living on the couch for about three months. He's got a pretty steady uh, drinking problem. He might have some issues. Kind of a waste job if you ask me, but anyway. <laughs> uh, we'll continue on here. So you the rest of the place. Uh, this is my token black buddy. Adam, he says uh, things like yo and what's up. Yo, what's up? Then we continue on. It is a four bedroom house. So this is my room. Got a bunch of snake stuff around here, some display cages. I got my camera, all the gear. A uh, nice little Burton bag for it all to go in since I am a pretty avid photographer. Uh, my bedroom, it's got a mat, bed. We got the wolf head here. Uh, it used to be a full body, but it was all rotten and stuff, so it just kept the head. Then we got a walk in closet. I got one of the bigger closets. <laughs> Take you upstairs, show you the rest of the place. Back to the kitchen again. And then we got upstairs here. We got the master bathroom, two sinks, you know, 
face is bad to him. This is where all the magic happens. Pop a squat here. So this is my favorite room in the whole house. This is the snake room. This is what I do. I breed snakes. There's over 40 reptiles in here. Uh, we'll start out showing you these. <laughs> this is uh, my breeding pair. You can see I got an albino in there with this hypo girl. Uh, then we work our way down. We have the anatheristic boa. Come down one more cage. We got uh, Xena. Or sorry, Athena and Menelos, the motley and the normal. They bred for me last year. Hopefully I'm going to get some more babies out of them. Come down one more, you got Zeus. He's a pastel boa. He's pretty friendly. He was actually my first boa. Uh, carry on. Then we got the baby rack over here. There's a few assorted corn snakes in here. Take this guy out and show you. This is the... Amalistic striped corn snake. Uh, he's pretty cool. He's one of the brighter corn snakes I got. Uh, we've got the blizzard corn in here. He's pure white. Uh, and then we got some of the keepers from my last clutch. We have uh, the normal and then three motleys, three various motleys. This guy's one of the biggest. Almost pure black. He's a sexy beast. And that is Atlas. And then we have two more Motley's. Morpheus and Apollo. Uh, Apollo. So those are some of the guys I produced. Uh, I was one of the second breeders ever in Canada to produce them. So I'm pretty excited about that and hopefully I'll be getting more this year. Then we have uh, various boas in here. We got Xena up top here. You can see her, she's coming to check things out. That's Xena, she's a 100% head annery. Continue, continue down, continue down. We got Hyprion in here. She's trying to make a run for it. That's uh, the one year old Hypo boa. Some real nice coloration to him. He just set shed too, and hopefully he'll be breeding for me next year. Then we got a few more corn snakes. We got a uh, Poseidon there, Annery Motley corn. And then we have the snow corn, Boreas. She's one of my first corn snakes. Produced three litters for me, and been a pretty good breeder so far. We have Apollo. He's my biggest corn snake. He is an anatheristic corn snake, so he lacks all red pigment. And you can see he's pretty much a full grown corn snake at about four feet. And then lastly, in the shell here, we have this one, which is an animal motley. And this one is a male and is going to be breeding for me next year too. Put him back in there. A couple more boas in here to show you. We have my favorite, which is the jungle boa down here. And this is a tank I found. It used to be a display case. It actually makes a pretty rad tank. This is my ride, 2004 Audi A4. 1.8p and I got it all blacked out, the black tint, so all black rims with the chrome lip, with the logo on the back. And yeah, that's pretty much my everyday cruiser. So you've seen enough, now get the heck out of here.